Aujourd'hui, le JT vous emmène chez Zim et ici, on est au cœur de la production. Allez, on y va. Tout démarre ici avec les pièces détachées, on va les assembler et petit à petit on va aller vers le bout de l'usine avec le câblage et on va finir par les tests parce que toute machine est testée bien sûr avant de partir. Martine, cette machine c'est la première machine produite ici. So this is actually one of our very first models, it's our CB7D from 1983. And actually, it still would work. You see a lot of the components are historic now. Also here we have still round images, quite old machine, but basic components haven't changed. So we have a generator and a detector. Tell us a little bit about the history of the company. Well, we are in front of the timeline. The machine we saw was 1983. Walk us uh, on the history of the company. We then started in 87 to produce in bigger numbers. So in this first facility we had, we could produce up to 50 units a year. And we are kind of proud on this milestone here. Zim Imaging was the first company to have a flat panel C-arm. Some milestone of the company, here are some components. We exhibit some of the main core components of the CRM technology and we're kind of proud on this exhibit here from 2006. It was the first flat panel that was integrated in our vision CRM that went to mass market production. So the first flat panel CRM in the market. From those panels, now we go through to those panels. On these current high-end panels, we have the CMOS technology in, more modern high-resolution technology. Initial ones were um, of MRF silicon, and this is the latest technology, and it's called CMOS. Implemented 3D as well, so the machine could acquire 3D images. Latest milestone I like to mention here is 2014, where we presented our RFD 3D product line, a 3D CRM with 3131 31 image size here which we still have strongly in the market. Also a milestone for us is 2020, where we have acquired the French daughter Terenva, um, a company in Rennes, which you also, I think, visited already before. And together with Terenva, we do image fusion and pioneer in vascular surgery. Tell us about the founder of the company, Erzim. So we need to go back a bit. So actually, Jürgen Zim founded the company here in 1972 and he started to pioneer in the field of exposure control. So the first products he offered was reducing radiation dose to existing fixed CRMs. He found out he's also quite good in innovating on mobile CRMs. This was the first products that were designed and we just in the showroom showed uh, our old CP70. Jürgen Zim. Was he an engineer or a clinician? Jürgen Siem from his education was an engineer, but it's always important to combine clinical knowledge with engineering. And actually another clinician that was very important for our pioneering work is Dr. Lutz Helmig. He was a clinician and together with him and other technicians here uh, in Siem, we have developed the first DSA, digital subtraction angiography on a mobile CR machine. And actually, Dr. Lutz Helmig, he's now um, our main shareholder. He's the um, boss of the Aton company, and he's still with his two daughters, owning the Zim, the Orthoscan, and the Terenva company. So this is really the bare bone of the company, cooperation between clinician and engineer. This is what Zim is all about. I think that hits it quite well. We need to always benchmark any technological innovation together with clinicians because it has to have a, a clinical meaning. We don't do it for the technology's sake only. Voilà, ici on arrive dans la zone de test. Chaque machine va être testée avant le départ de l'usine. Après les premiers tests, on pousse la machine dans ses retranchements. Dans cette pièce, on va contrôler les radiations pendant 16 heures. This is the high-end product of the range. 
So this is our RFD Hybrid Edition, um, which is dedicated for cardiovascular applications. So we have the strongest generator in the CR market with a 30kW generator and a 12-inch flat panel. Um, the system is completely motorized, so we can also just move it by using our joysticks. Um, and so we are able to do nearly all hybrid OR procedures with our mobile hybrid solution. This is the system. Now let's talk about the images. Yeah, so here you see some um, vascular images. So that's a um, subtraction angiography. So where we can see that we see even the smallest ves vessels quite sharp. So we see all the dynamic in the image. Yeah, so for a vascular surgeon, everything you need, you can see here on our image. Additionally, we have also some tools that can help the physician during the procedure. So that means we can um, just press one button to automatically mark our vessels. So no need for doing a road mapping or something like that. You can just mark it by pressing one button and use it that for navigation purposes afterwards. Let's move to the other screen. Together with our daughter company Terenva, we offer um, a solution for image fusion and intraoperative 3D vascular navigation. So that means the endonaut is just connected with the video cable with our C-arm and then we can match pre-operative CT data that was prepared using EndoSize, the planning software, intraoperatively for navigation. So you see the outlines of the vessels on top of the live image that helps to navigate um, without the need to do road mapping where you have a really high dose and you can really save contrast media and dose by just using the preoperative CT, CT data that is already available preoperatively to do the diagnosis really in the OR and see all your plannings, all your strategies right on the screen in the OR during your procedure. And on the right side on the screen. So that's the 3D rendering coming from the CT data. So you have always available in 3D all the information from the CT. You can have a look at the anatomy of the patient again. Um, you also have the opportunity to see the um, CT slices. So we can also go through all the slices, look at each slice of the CT again, or do intraoperative measurements to make sure you have the, the right stand length or the, the um, strategy during the procedure is, is like you planned it before. What are the main benefits of this room as a whole? So as a whole, it means you have the ceiling mounted monitors, the mobile C-arm, the mobile navigation system. So everything's mobile, so you can move it easily from one OR to the other. And especially in the combination of the C-arm and the endonaut, you can really save a lot of contrast media, a lot of dose, because you use the preoperative data again, and also save time just by using that um, navigation together with the really sharp and good image quality of our CR. What is the feedback so far of a clinician about this room? Clinicians really like that they are flexible. So if there's a free OR, they can just move in the C-arm and start the procedure. No need for uh, long construction times, like for fixed systems, for example. And especially in the mobile C-arm market, we are really one of the best, we have one of the best image quality um, regarding cardiovascular applications. So for vascular applications, our DSA images and also our fluoroscopic images are at really high quality. So together with navigation, and the, the image quality from our C-arm, we offer a really great solution for vascular surgeons. Ça y est, je suis un radiologue interventionnel, j'ai pris le contrôle de la machine. So we've been working through the range. There's a machine for each need. Right, not every surgeon needs the same C-arm. We have a mini C-arm over there, hand and foot surgeon, quite compact 2D C-arm for small ORs and a big fully motorized machine for the special needs, be it in cardiovascular or cardiology. And last but not least here, our 3D system, specially useful in orthopedics and in combination with navigation systems, for instance. Nils, last but not least, the 3D. Exactly, the Seam Vision RFD 3D, our premium product, um, used for 3D imaging, and you can also have 
when you have the 3D workflow, you can choose between the different patient sizes, so from child to adult over LPK, late, large patient key. And you can also use um, different body regions. So you have the spine or you can have a hand or whatever. So because we have the non-isocentric movement that makes it possible to not only be in the center of the body, but also besides that. Here you can see a 3D scene taken from a spine. And um, from this scene then the MPR is created. Mm -hmm. And with our um, flat panel detector 20 by 20, you really have all the details that you need within the images. What is the feedback you get from a, a clinician? What do they like on the machine? Mm, C arms are used intraoperatively so that you don't have revision surgery and therefore you need the superb image quality. And that is what we give to our end customers and they are very happy about it. This is the past. What is the future for Zim? We think that the topic of artificial intelligence will bring a lot. I think this technology will merge more in the OR and we are pretty confident that also with what we did together now with Terenva, will drive the cardiovascular segment a lot. Martin, this is the production site. Give us some figure. Here in the production site in Nuremberg, we produce around about 1,400 CRMs. So each working day, we also ship a lot of those. And together with our colleagues from Orthoscan and Torenva, we do about uh, 1,600 units we ship globally throughout all these stores here. Après les premiers tests, après les tests de radiation, avant que les machines partent chez le client, il faut tester euh, toutes les fonctions et toute la mécanique. C'est ici que ça se passe. Ici, on va tester les écrans, on va tester le bruit, on va tester euh, les différents mouvements de la machine euh, pour être sûr que tout soit OK. C'est contrôlé, c'est emballé, c'est prêt à partir. Talking about globally, in how many countries do you uh, sell uh, CRMs? We have a representation in almost all the countries in the world. For us, it's quite important to have a good service network. So, for instance, there's some countries where we just cannot ensure to have service engineers on site. In some African countries at this point, we can't offer. But if there is the infrastructure, if there is engineers being able to service, we're there around. Ici, on est dans le service support. Et ce qui est intéressant, c'est que là, on le voit en direct. Ils sont en connexion avec un hôpital. Et quelqu'un à l'hôpital filme le problème et on lui donne une réponse. On peut même parfois accéder directement à la machine. What is the booming market right now? We see a lot of activities for sure in China. Uh, our market share is very, very good here in Europe, also in the US. China is growing, but there's also a lot of local manufacturers as well. Um, but I think also in Asia, there's a big, big uh, driver for, uh, for healthcare industry with the young population also uh, getting older there. Here we are in a special area of Germany, which is called Medical Valley. Right. The area here, Nuremberg, Erlangen, Fürth, uh, is an area famous for the engineering and medical industry. We also have big university clinics here. For us, it's also strong to be now together with our Turenba colleagues in Rennes, France. So we use from the good young people uh, driving also here software development, all the latest technologies we spoke about to make a good yeah, European project out of it.